All right, all right, all right. It's Mitch from Mini Riders. How you doing, guys? I um, apologize that I haven't done a video for you last week. Easter coupled, coupled with uh, I had to go overseas for, for a conference made it a, quite a difficult thing to, to fit in, to slot in for you guys. So, to make it up, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you something really cool. Um, I am in Bali in Indonesia and I'm at an uh, Anthony Robbins event and Anthony Robbins talks all about mindset and as you guys would know, mindset is very very important when it comes to racing or, or anything where you're in competition because if you think you're going to crash, you normally do and I'm here to learn strategies to, to make sure that I'm performing my best all the time especially in my business, in, in my personal life and um, yeah, so I'm going to show you something really, really awesome, which is the, the beach right in front of the resort here, which is just behind me, and my light sort of disappeared a bit, but you can see, like, the resort's just here, and we've got the beach, like, just behind us. So just going into to, to a few housekeeping things, the Vert Max drama with the name change, that's all sorted. He has, it, it, Russ has um, started a new business name, which he, which he's going to sell those bikes under. So you guys need to get some quality bikes under a different business name, but still going to be solid quality from Russ there. Um, I've got two people who are interested in doing interviews. And um, by the way, it's really, really hot here. I think it's about 45, 50 degrees. No, probably about 45. Very humid. Um, I've currently got two interviews and I really would like to, to interview some more guys uh, about riding, about racing, your influence in the community and what you, you want to do, what you want to achieve. So please email me or, or post on the blog if you're interested in doing those interviews. And um, last but not least, I'm going to, to share with you, I met a, a gentleman here by the name of Glenn and he plays in a band and for, I can't for the life of me remember what it's called. It's the... The conspiracy, the conspiracy plan, I'm told. So he's going to talk for about 15, 20 seconds about his band, and I think you guys will really like it. It's, um, it's targeted, a lot, a lot of his followers are, are motorbike riders and in the industry. So I'm here with Glenn, and um, do you want to yeah. tell, <laughs> tell us a little bit about your band and what you guys do and where you've been featured? I'd love to, Mitch. My name's Glenn, as Mitch said earlier, I'm from a band called The Conspiracy Plant, and we're from Wollongong in Australia, and we play sort of pop punk music, it's probably similar to stuff like Green Day, and I guess Franz or Rom, and bands that I really used to listen to back in high school, awesome. and we've been on Trail Bike Adventure Mag before on their DVD, so you might have seen us from there, so we've kind of uh, been around, around the traps for probably the last three years. We play a lot sort of around Wollongong, Kiama, I've been doing a lot of high school gigs. We've been playing down in Melbourne, up at Brisbane, Byron Bay, and that sort of thing. And we've got some more regional tours planned for this year. So look us up, called The Conspiracy Plan. Hope you enjoy the music. I'll be um, posting a link to, to Glenn's um, his website on the blog. And um, once again, to those who are currently leading the competition, kick and ask, but you guys can do like, whoever's coming first, which I won't name them, you can very easily overtake them. So it's just, just referring people to the site, your link's in, and it's all self-explanatory in the, in the thread. Um, so yeah, check out the band, there's going to be some new products coming soon when I get back to Oz, and some stuff that you'll be really interested in. So looking forward to speaking to you soon. Thanks guys.